Hi guys, it's Elf here from Instro West. Here today to show you the Drux 611. Uh, this Drux in an Instro West case that, that we knock up uh, for our clients so that they can keep all their goodies in the one spot. Enables them to grab the, grab the calibrator, throw it in the back of a U, whatever, run out on site. So if we open it up, have a quick look at what we got in here. So we've got our, our manual and then also in there's our calibration certificate. Obviously when you get this to site, we recommend you file this away. Okay, also we've got in here, this, this unit's come with two hoses. Um, there's a spot for two different hoses. We've got our lead set right here. We've got some alligator clips, test connectors, etc. So, all good. We've also got a power supply here, should you want to be using this on the bench in your workshop. A set of, spare set of batteries because guaranteed when you get out of sight the person that used it before you has left it flat for you. We've also got some test connectors. So these test connectors are the new truck ones. They're a great little unit, they're an O-ring test connector set. So this, this case itself has a set of BSP and a set of MPT. And we've got a dust and moisture trap, so it stops the dirt getting into the pump unit on the calibrator. Okay, so if we run into the calibrator here, pull that out. So this is a 20 bar unit, so it's good for 0 to 20 bar. Okay, so we can power the unit up. There you go, so at the moment this is set up for a switch test. If we want to change what sort of test we're doing with this, we simply swipe across, select a calibrator, and select what we want to do. So let's say we want to do a pressure transmitter, um, and we want to power it off the unit. This here tells us where we're going to power it off, and it tells us 24 volts on, so that's the one we want. Select that, and away we go. Okay, so we're now set up for milliamps and pressure. We can just show you that pressure changing state if you want. See, see how it works. It's just my finger on it. So your instrument might might not be in millibar. It might be in psi, kPa, etc. So to change that, we click on the pressure section. Click on the settings. Go to units, and we select the units we want. So as you can see here, we got a, a range of different units depending on what, what it is you're chasing. So we just had PSI there, so we can just select PSI. That's in PSI. We go back, we're now in PSI. Again, easy enough if we want to change that to KPA. Just select, the, select KPA, go back. So it's really simple to change the units. Um, nothing hidden about that. Okay, the, the other thing, you might want to do is, as we said before, the switch test. So again, just to change back to a different function, swipe across, select calibrator, select the function you want. Now you can set these up in a favorites list if you want them, just to save you some time. Okay, so there you have it. If you'd like any more information on the Druck DPI 611, all the other pressure models, 612, 620, uh, jump on our website. Have a look around, it's www.instrowest.com.au or alternatively give us a call on 08 9500 9120.